welcome to you my name is Dale and this is Dale's Addiction this is our second last oh I get to say it it's our penultimate subscriber unboxing for 2023 a massive thank you to everybody who has shared their unboxings for the month of November I have been a little slow to edit this video um, because A, there's a lot of submissions and B, it's just been really busy. As you might know, I haven't been able to do Grinchmas this year and editing this video, it takes a bit of time. Um, that's not by any means saying that I have done a super professional job or anything like that. It is still very amateur. But I think the heartwarming thing about these videos is, is that they're yours. You guys get to see all the time what I'm buying, what I'm interested in. And I love the fact that we get to see what you're buying and what you're, what you're, blah, 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 you're interested in when we watch this video. So... I've already said thank you, but thank you to everybody who has contributed this year. Thank you especially to LVLover.81, who is the winner of the Dale's Addiction handbag hook for the best unboxing for this particular video. Three beautiful pieces. Wait until you see them. A massive congratulations to Nin from Brisbane in this video. You'll see why when you uh, when you watch her unboxing as well. To those of you who do the voiceovers, who even put yourself in front of the camera, like I just, I can't thank you enough. I know how much courage it takes, especially when it's not something that you do all the time. If you are interested in submitting an unboxing for the final unboxing, which will probably go live in January because we'll capture everybody's Christmas and New Year's shopping and, and gifts that they've bought themselves or received um, then check out the video link in the description box below please watch the video and follow the instructions it makes my life so much easier that you film it in landscape mode not in portrait and yeah that's that, that's as easy as it, as it is and just keep it to less than a minute you can DM me on Instagram all the instructions are there anyway thank you to everybody um, let's go see what they bought <laughs> Oh my goodness, I've got a bad habit of missing videos. Thank you for your patience, Mayrit. She's submitting this wonderful Loewe unboxing along with her little pal, who will feature shortly, named Luca. Now she has customized her charm. I love this outdoor unboxing with this beautiful mini puzzle. Beautiful. I wish I could say the bag was the star of the show, but you're about to find out who the star of the show really is. Here he comes. Hey, Luca. <laughs> you little cutie. You remind me of Alf. Oh, what a lovely afternoon. Here's the bag. Congratulations. Now we have a submission from my good friend Eileen in Melbourne. She picked up a bunch of Chanel shoes, just wandered into the boutique. Oh, here's some uh, fabulous wedge boots and some slingbacks. And these Jimmy Choo boots are next level. She doesn't know I'm putting them in, but I am because wow. Now our next unboxing comes from Georgie in Melbourne as well. She went on a hunt for these shoes for her recent birthday and ended up finding them sold out everywhere through the fabulous Gab Walla. They are the Alaya. Let's see. I don't know the exact name, but they're like a ballet flat with crystal embellishment. These are really interesting because they are very modern, but then if they didn't have all of the crystals, they'd be very, say, the row. But with the crystals, instead of the laser cut like Alaya is famous for, they kind of have this really modern look about them, like a, a ballet slipper slash, I don't know. I don't know how to describe these, but I just think they're really, really interesting. And Georgie loved them so much that she hunted them down through Gab, the personal shopping service. 
She's even gone as far as to film them outside in the sunshine so that we can see how beautiful and glimmery sparkly they are. She sent me lots and lots of footage. Even her baby girls love this one. You hear the screaming in the background? Thanks for sharing, Georgie. And now we have Tanaz and she's got a couple of unboxings for us. She always picks up the goodies and I met her in London, which was fabulous, from Louis Vuitton. The clay, the key pouch in the winter theme. What she got here? We talked about this, didn't we? We talked about this bag. Some noodles, okay, mi goreng, um, right. Okay, they're out of the packet, what's going on? We've got a box. <laughs> I love her unboxings, they're the best. Um, okay, what's for dinner? Uh, Ring? No. Okay, we have a a looks to be like a top handle strap. Is this a bag? Look at her face. She's so happy. <laughs> it's a noodle box bag. Oh my goodness me. Oh, and you can wear it on the shoulder too. How versatile. Throw that one on too for us. Let's have a look. How might we wear this, you ask? <laughs> Here's some inspiration. <laughs> Thanks, Tanaz. This gorgeous Fendi Petite interlace peekaboo in burgundy was a quick love affair for Kendrea because she took it back when she found out she could get the navy small peekaboo ICU in the interlace through some special connection she has because this one did not come to Australia. So she was one lucky gal to hunt this down. It just speaks to her soul, her no by year. She's broken that rule again. Community, I am delighted to share my latest pre-loved piece to commemorate a huge career milestone of mine and to celebrate and really make sure I commemorate this huge milestone that I've been working 25 years towards. It's a beautiful piece that was actually inspired by you, Dale. A beautiful classic Louis Vuitton piece, which is not only beautiful, but really, really functional. So something I could admire on the shelf, as well as admire when I use. I wonder what it could be. That's right. I have got my hands on the Louis Vuitton trunk clutch. A really, really beautiful piece inspired by you, Dale, inspired by the Petite Mal, and a piece that I can have for my entire life and really remember this special time of my life and a really exciting leadership opportunity for me for my career. Thanks so much for sharing the excitement. I love it. I love it too. Congratulations. Okay, what have we got here from LVLover.81 in Sydney? She has gone mad with our shared sales associate at Elizabeth Street, Aaron. Hook a girl up with a beautiful fuchsia baguette. Oh, you guys know I love this one because I have the mini in this color. I looked at it everywhere overseas and eventually I bought mine through Aaron. <gasps> Say what? You got the strap too? What a great idea. I have this strap too, guys. Highly recommend. Great picks. But wait, there is still more. Look at all these boxes. Oh, it's a special box. What have we got inside? Open the paper and it will up. It's the petite in the holiday season sparkles. These bags, these are probably some of the best sparkly bags that Fendi have done in terms of practicality. 
it's growing on me in terms of the the edges they definitely are because i'm just mesmerized by the sparkles look at that insane i love 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 this holiday collection from fendi <gasps> but what there's more what's in this box okay oh it's looking like a baguette to me but which one is it <gasps> No way, we're twinning again. It's the silver crackly regular size baguette from the holiday season. I got this one in the mini too. Such a great choice. It has inspired me to go on quite the bag hunt, I have to say. Oh, they're just beautiful. And I love how you've unboxed these. Oh, and you got that strap, amazing. I think you're the winner of, um, of the unboxings for uh, the late November video, girlfriend. Hi, Dale. Um, it's Sheila again from Miami. And this time it's an unexpected unboxing. Um, I always wanted a uh, canvas suka print uh, baguette. Um, not really sure which one would it be. And I saw this one from the new collection and definitely it had all the checks. Um, it's different, it's, it has a cool vibe. You can use it at any time, day or night, if you put a chain on it. It's really a good substantial piece and uh, it has the cute pockets. I don't think really they're too practical, but you know, I leave them stuffed so it keeps the shape. Um, and it's really an awesome, super cool piece and I love it. Um, so it's out there right now on, on the website and at the store and it was a surprise for me as I'm sure it is for you. Hi Dale, this is Sheila again from Miami and I got a surprise for you. This time it's the orange box, the famous one, but no, it's not a quota bag. It's actually a pretty functional everyday bag um, that was offered in a neutral color, which for me is different and surprised, but it works pretty good. It's a grab and go. So it's the Bucket Picoton in 18, and um, it has this very soft little flap that you can put the clochette that comes with it. Um, I think it's more for the weight that it causes, so it keeps the flap down. Um, and it's just, it can be functional or not, um, as you want. And also I got for it a um, insert um, to give some structure to the bag and some light color so things don't get lost with Dale's Addiction um, coupon from Zumoni. Congratulations, Sheila. I love your unboxings. Hi Dale, Geraldine in Vancouver with a couple of contributions to your November unboxings. A Constance to go wallet in a coupe with gold hardware, a little treat for my essay and a really nice surprise. A Kelly 28 in gold Tobo leather with gold hardware. So November indeed was very good to me in the handbag department. This whole year has been good to you in the handbag department, girlfriend. And now we're off to Singapore, where our favorite luxury lover from Singapore is sharing with us not a purchase, but a gift from Fendi. She thinks she might have spent a bit of money at Fendi this year. This beautiful python pouch in like a jade emerald green. Look at that with the FF clasp. Oh, the inside of it is just spectacular. I've never received a gift like this. You must be spending a lot. She's done an MTO, she says. She's done a, a made to order, but whatever you're doing, keep doing it because um, you've got amazing taste and I love seeing your unboxings every month. And next we are off to Dubai with Bunny. She's got two unboxings for us today, one from Cartier. We love the Cartier packaging, don't we? so fabulous let's pop it open and see what we've got inside the beautiful Cartier love earrings these little hoops oh there's diamonds there too for an extra bit of bling perfect choice for an everyday staple I'd say absolutely gorgeous congratulations and then our final unboxing from Goyard 
Now this is pretty interesting. Gouillard has a fun side. Who would have thought? This is the Villette Coat MM in green and it's got a little pupper on it. And uh, I'm instantly interested because that little whimsy touch, that does something to me. I wonder if this is a Dubai special, who knows? What a beauty, congratulations.